For every musician, it's always a fascinating experience to perform a live gig. But recording in the studio, that's a completely different story. You see, psychology is so strange and amazing at the same time. So I thought, why not ask an expert? Everybody knows that to record a good performance you need good vibes and a beautiful atmosphere. I was always wondering how that works. So we came to psychologist Mrs. Lea Kapoglu, who is an expert in human behavior, to get some answers. So tell me, doctor, how musicians can boost their performance. For most musicians, a performance in front of a live audience offers a new and unexpected experience. The enthusiasm of a live performance and the feeling of being the center of attention provoke body changes. We call this performance adrenaline. During the performance, the body is boosted by certain chemicals that come from the brain, such as endorphin, serotonin, dopamine and adrenaline. So, these chemicals affect the artist's breathing and voice? Exactly. Research has also shown that anxiety and excessive stress have a negative impact when it comes to the artist's focus for a good performance. To be more precise, we call this stage fright. However, it is a well-known fact that an artist can perform to the max with a live audience. The positive reaction from the crowd has a result on the artist that we call performance adrenaline. Okay, Alex. I've had a busy day today. Right. So we're going to crank up the volume. I want you to record the stud, cut the tape, and send it to the radio station. I don't have any time for this bullshit. All right, Mr. Manestra, uh, Thanasis is a great uh, music player. I have seen him live, and I'm telling you, this guy is really good. Okay, well, let's see what this kid's got. Roll the tape. All right, let's do this. Hear you. Listen here, you sound clown. Take your head out of your fucking ass. I'm telling you to tell this fucking dime under doll to sound like gold, to sound like dollar bills. You got it, you motherfucker. Okay, you. okay, okay, Mr. Manestra. Motherfucker. Okay. Hey, hey Thanasis, uh, that was very beautiful. Uh, we had a technical problem with the tape. Uh, would you mind if we do this one more time, please? Okay. Yeah, thank you. Stop, stop, stop. Listen here, you fucking cockroach. This sounds like a crock of shit. You're gonna make some fucking magic happening here. Tell the fucking jerk off to play some music. Music from his heart. You got it? Now fuck you, go to work. All right? You motherfucker, you. Okay, Mr. Manestra. Okay, okay Thanasis, uh, we still have a problem with the tape machine. Uh, would you mind if we take five? It is a well-known fact that an artist can perform to the max with a live audience. The positive reaction from the crowd has a result on the artist that we call performance adrenaline. Okay, listen, I have an idea. What we need is performance adrenaline. What the fuck is a performance adrenaline? Is it from this world? Is it from Mars? Is it from outer space? What no, the fuck, man? No, Mr. Manestra, hold on a minute here. I have an idea I'm telling you. We'll see where I'm going with this. Listen here, man. Listen here. You're gonna make this fucking happen. Do you understand? Do you fucking understand? Hold on a minute. I have an idea. I'm telling you, this is going to work. You will see where I'm going with this. You will see. Hey, Mr. Big, it's Alex. Hey, Alex. I need you immediately at the Sierra Studios. We need an adrenaline boost. Okay, no problem, my man. Hey, man, I owe you big time. You saved the day. Are you bringing the frog? No, the frog drowned itself. Really? Do you want a double fish? Relax, I will bring something fresh. I believe that Mr. Manestra will have a big appetite for double fish. Right on. 
Listen here, you dumb fuck. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna break yours and his fucking legs. You got it? All right, all right, Mr. Manisa, but you won't have to break not my legs, not his legs. Because uh, Mr. Big always has a solution. I'm gonna take this fucking phone, fucking ring Mr. Big, you fucking talk to him. You got it? That's why it is important applauding new musicians and stimulating them during studio recordings by, for example, having a crowd, as it will have a positive effect on their creativity. An artist's performance does not only depend on his professional experience, but also stems from unexpected situations that either occur under normal circumstances or that can be created technically. Technically? How? You should create the conditions that will seek out the musician. You need performance adrenaline. Hey, Mr. Big! Did you bring performance adrenaline? We know my lacas. There. What the hell is this guy on about? This is Mr. Big. This is Mr. Big! Fuck Mr. Big! Fuck you! Fuck Mr. Big! Fuck the camera, man! 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 Fuck the camera, Listen here, Sam. Come here. What is this performance adrenaline? The show goes on! Alex, cut the tape, send it to the radio station. Fucking amazing! When a musician is recording and he's thinking of something unpleasant, there won't be a good performance during recordings. Stimulate the musician by introducing him to a very likable person who will immediately have the effect to put him into overdrive and he will definitely perform much better. This is for you, my man. This is for you. Mr. Big, absolutely amazing. Amazing, amazing, brother, amazing. Yeah. Opa. Opa. Fucking performance adrenaline. Yeah. Thank you very much, Mrs. Capoglu, for being here with us on the Sierra sessions, and thank you, YouTube, for watching this video, and hope to see you again soon. Listen here, you sound clown. Take your head out of your ass. I'm telling you to tell the fucking fucker, motherfucker, Bambali. <laughs> <laughs> motherfucker. Who's the gift? Ma è un po' come la palla, ma
the fuck is a performance of Rowley? You really see it? Is it from here? Is it from another planet? Another fucking galaxy? Your own fucking adventure? Hold oh, on, wait, wait. Yes? Hello? 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 Queen? They're worried about it. Okay, listen. I have an idea. I'll fair move back. Thank you, my boss. Εγώ δεν ξέρω αν λογούσε ένα μάλα κατ' όταν λέω τι λέω τώρα εγώ. Εγώ δεν ξέρω αν λογούσε ένα μέρος του γυρίσματος. Τι λέω τώρα. Δεν ξέρω να πω. Hold on a minute here. I have an idea. I have an idea. Hold on a minute here. I have an idea. You have an idea. Yeah. You fucking have an idea. Oh fucking you tell me about you fucking idea. What fucking idea have you got? What the fuck have you got? What do we need? What do we need? Now come here! What do we need? <laughs> Scribe. Yeah. Well, let me tell you, you motherfucker, you... <laughs> Mr. Big always has a solution. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna fucking break his... <laughs> I'm gonna fucking break his... <laughs> you got it? I got it, I got it, okay, okay. I'm not sure if he's going to work. <laughs> okay, you got it. Mr. Big! Did you bring the pro Mr. Big? <laughs> there! <laughs> <laughs> Ahí está podía tú, dignos y otro más menos que te has puesto a pano, fue sin acto ahora. Ne, ne. Έλα, έλα, μην γελάς. Ωραίο, ωραίο, ωραίο το πήγες. Ωραίο το πήγες, ωραίο το πήγες. Ωραίο το πήγες, αλλά δεν μπορώ να το βλέπω. Να σου πω, φύγε καλύτε. Φύγε, εντάξει. Χωρίς εσένα. Φύγε, 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 φύγε. Λίγο αυτή η ορμαλιά και εγώ. Πάμε. Τι κάνει ακριβώς, τίποτα απλά κοιτάει. Γενικά. Okay, listen. I had a.